Hello, my name is Slavi Marinov. In this video, I'm going to show you how to insert download links on your WordPress site. I'm going to show you two ways to do it. So let's first create a test site. By the way, I'm going to be using a service called Q Sandbox, which allows you to set up a free test site so you can experiment with plugins and themes. So let's create this one. Less than two seconds, that's nice. Let's go to admin. Let's quickly update it. Okay, so the first step is to insert the files. Let's go to add new. We need either we can either drag and drop files or we can select the files. Actually, let's drag and drop. This is a sample file in one version is it is PDF and the other one is doc MS document. PDF. Close. The other one is okay. So we have the files. Let's click on the library and we see the files here. That's nice. Shows it unattached. So the next step is to create a download page. And we need to click on add media and we need to go to media library select the first file you can select the okay let's select one at a time we have the files here okay let's pick this and let's publish it let's view it and it shows up nicely. The links are pointing to the right files. Let's click on the PDF and the PDF right now opens up in the browser. Let's click on the other file and the other file doesn't open in the browser. So that's the first way to do it. Let me show you another way to do it using a free plugin that, that is normally used for e-commerce. But when you add a product, and set the price to zero, it's gonna be offered for download. It's not gonna be opened within the browser like this one. Because some users, they may not know they have to click on one of the buttons in order to download the file right here. It's not user friendly. So what you wanna do is the user to be prompted to download the file. Let's do that. Downloads, actually dashboard and plugins, add new to search for cyber store. And you hit enter or press search button plugins. Let's install it. Let's activate the plugin. Let's go to products. And there's no products here yet. So we need to add the products. It's gonna be zero dollars. Let's pick the file. Let's pick the PDF file and add the product. In zero dollars let's pick the file and the plugin adds those shortcodes but they're not necessary there's an, an, an easier way to insert those codes let's go again to pages go to downloads Click better downloads and we can do is press that icon here and we need to insert this short code and let's do it one more time. We need to update. Now what we forgot is we need to configure Orbisia Cyber Store because it, it is an e-commerce plugin which allows you to add a simple buy now button and you can be selling e-products or reports and so on. But in order to work, it requires a valid PayPal account. Let's do that. Let's enable it here. And you can insert your, your email, your PayPal account and save it, save changes. And that's it. Okay, let's go to the site. Let's go to downloads. And here you can see better downloads to files. You can click. And then it's gonna, the PDF file is now offered as download. The other one works the same. It is quite nice. 
and the, the default version was to open the file in the browser, which is not good. In the future, there will be an extension that will be able to count the downloads. But if you want to find more extensions for Orbisius Cyberstore, then go to Orbisius slash go slash Cyberstore. Thanks and have a great day. Bye.